Hi guys, welcome back to this fourth tutorial about the application realized with NativeScript and Angular 2. We will arrive to implement the new address book page linked with the login page. Sorry, it needs to refresh. Okay, now it's refreshing. Okay, and now insert username and password. Press login. Okay, this is our address book page in which we have also the, the button new contact and of course now the DB is empty so we, we can't see anything in this in this page but we have the, the button and in this tutorial we have to, to implement the new page the new contact page in order to add a new item in database and see this item in the address book page so let's add a new component Type script file, okay. Add contact dot component dot typescript, okay. And of course, we need also the template. So, new HTML file and uh, with the same name, add contact dot component dot HTML, okay. Remove of this and copy and paste from address book, okay. Now we have to, to change the selector with add contact template add contact and also the class okay add contact perfect okay now we can remove public add contact and also we can remove this variable and body in the constructor but we need database service because we have to add the new contact so we can add this address of type address okay and this is our new contact we have already the uh, import so this address we can initialize this this variable with a username an empty username and an empty number okay so we need now uh, of course a new public save contact method which we have to call the database service and add the new contact so for now we can write if this address username is not empty and of course also this address dot number number okay it's not empty okay now we can call the, the database service so this database service and insert that wants um, a type address like param the uh, Address no needs this okay. This address, so now we have then and in rest there is the ID of the new item, but for now we need the router extensions for navigate. Okay, we have to add to the constructor, remember the import. Okay, now the script Angular and Router. Okay, now we can navigate when we add a new item, new contact. We have to uh, navigate to the address book list, which we have to see the, the new item in, in the list, of course. So, navigate and the route for address book. And we want, of course, to, to clear the history in order to don't go back to the new contact page so we have also the case in which the address or the number is empty so we have to to show a feedback and alert to the user so fields are not valid okay okay now we need public cancel but in this case we have just to navigate to the address book list 
because the user want to go back and he he doesn't do any action in this page so for now we need of course the, the template so a new action bar with a title a title okay new contact with a class action bar and the stack layout of our main container with a class class page and orientation vertical vertical okay and in stack layout we have of course our text field and our placeholder username and our data binding our model ng model address dot username and close text field okay copy and paste and this is for number address number and placeholder number okay now just add the button okay new button with text uh, save and tap save contact okay and another one for cancel so cancel and cancel okay template is done so we can try this but before we have to add a new declaration in the app module so add contact component remember of course to import okay modules address book and a new route for this page so path add contact and the component is add contact component okay okay now we are ready to, to try this this new page but we need of course the route in order to go to this new page so just copy and pass again navigation for this for this route with router extensions again private nav router extensions extensions okay and the import is this with router and in this case we have just to navigate to add contact okay now we're ready to try this application and username in order to log in password okay the empty list new contact okay this is our new contact we can go back to the address book we want to add jack okay 392298 okay this is not my number of course <laughs> okay press save and this is our item in the list we can try with poll for example plus 40 6489 and so on save and this is the other one so now we have the new contact page in order to add a new item in the list we go to the address book list and we can in this case see all our contacts so the database is working fine and just add a new image like the login but it's just uh, a cosmetic <laughs> for our uh, application so see the, the image nice okay it's nice <laughs> cancel okay and everything is is working so okay this is Mike Mike my friend quick you can call my friend uh, this is a real number <laughs> you can try and we can add just one style for our list view okay margin without plus okay margin same margin for list view and of course also the padding okay font size 20 what's the difference 
Fostrick, Fostrick. Okay, Jack Paul and Mike. Now we have an application with just uh, a name contact list without the number, so we have, we have forgot the number and we have to add a new stack layout in the template in order to to add uh, a container in this in this list view and we can add this label we can put this label inside for the username but we ha we need also the the label for number so copy and pass this label and remove name of course okay and change username with number so now we have all information we are storing in the DB so now we can see changes in our application so go to the address book list okay but it's not so nice so we have just to customize our CSS so we can set the height of the list view okay now we can see changes again oh, now it's it's beautiful <laughs> it's a list okay it's good now okay guys I hope you understand how to use native script and angular 2 in order to store data in an application of course this is just a sample but you can reuse this tutorial to realize bigger and more complex application for your purposes. And we are at the end. So don't forget to subscribe to our channel and follow us to our social pages. And see you guys.